<laughs> okay, um, so I'm making lunch um, today and I'm just cracking up because I, I, I totally need this wrong. I don't even know what this is. I don't know where it came from. I don't know where I bought it or when I bought it. I'm guessing it might be from Daiso, um, but I found it in the back of my pantry and I was like, I wish I had some ramen or something. So I just started digging around and I thought, okay, this seems pretty close. But it's not a uh, soup. It's just you cook the noodles and then you put it, you drain the water, put it in a bowl. And then I thought, I thought that was the point at which you add the, the powder and the sauce and the, I, I didn't even know this was in here actually. But um, yeah, so I pulled out the sauce and stuff and then I, I realized we have some little dried veggies and I'm like, that seems weird to add that at this stage. And I realized you are actually supposed to add that when you cook it with the water. So <laughs> now I don't know what to do now. I don't, this is like, like I know how to cook, but I don't know what to do here. Okay, I'm actually totally fine with this. It was a blessing in disguise. So I don't want to say I'm working hard tonight, but I'm on my second LaCroix in like an hour. What are you doing? Are you okay? You okay? You got hiccups? You got hiccups? You're gonna puke? What's going on? So I just finished writing the contact form for my walk and train. And I still have to finish the walk and train page itself. I'm going to try, not try. I'm going to finish it tonight. Do or do not. There is no try. So I'm going to finish that tonight. And then hopefully that means that there's going to be less vlogs of me just sitting here. <laughs> Today I went to the dentist and you can't really vlog at the dentist, but I wanted to tell you about it because uh, my hygienist was talking about, she asked, what do I do? And, you know, I told her and she she started telling me about her dogs and um, some training issues specifically with walking that she's having um, and you know she's just telling me all about her dogs and all of the problems and stuff and normally it annoys me so much when uh, they want to talk to you while they're cleaning your teeth because it's like it's not that I don't want to talk I like just can't have a conversation with like hands in my mouth you know so normally I do not like it I'm not a fan but today I was ready to have a full conversation I was like, yes, please tell tell me more. <laughs> and so I gave her my website. I didn't have my card with me, but um, I realized I've been giving a lot of people my website and my card lately um, who are interested in learning more about training and there's nothing on my website about training. So, I mean, they can still go there and contact me. And if we have had a face-to-face -face conversation, obviously like they have an idea of like what I do, um, but it would be very helpful to have actual an actual training page. So the first draft of my training page was um, breaking down like different programs and different behavior issues. And it was just, I think it was too complicated just for a first launch. Um, so I decided to focus on walk and train, especially because that really fits in with the pet sitting and dog walking that I'm already doing. Um, it wouldn't be too different from my current routine. Other than that, I would be also doing the initial consultation and communicating with clients um, and like assigning homework and stuff like that. So the contact form is done. The, the website, the, the page is not quite done. It's like mostly done. It just needs some adjustments. I think um, I, it was mostly done about a week ago, but I think I just needed to like kind of ruminate on it for a little bit and like I know I need to make some edits and kind of make a couple things more clear and streamline a couple of things and I just needed to like process and now I'm ready to go back to it. So I think whatever I end up with at the end of the night, that's what's going public and that's what I'm posting because I'm sure once I start taking clients, you know, I'm probably pretty soon going to add like a frequently asked questions section. Um, but I think once I start taking clients, like it's gonna become clear like if people are asking me the same questions or if there's like information that it seems like I'm missing, I can go back in and add stuff. So I'm trying to just like remind myself this is a first draft and also that the important stuff is the training itself. Like if there's a little mistake or something that I don't 100% love on the website, like that's that's fine. Like it just, the training is what matters. So anyway, it's 6.30 now. Um, I just finished making dinner. So I think I'm gonna eat and continue working on this. 
I'm gonna try to give myself a deadline of one hour. Now that the form is done and all I have to do is edit this, um, I think I can do it in an hour. Um, so I'm gonna come back in and check in when I'm done and um, wish me luck. Okay, so the website is basically done. It's There's one little section that I have left to finish. Um, it's gonna be like three sentences. I just have to explain uh, what happens during a consultation. Um, and then it's done. And I'm gonna go to bed right now. I don't know, not, not right now, right now. <laughs> it's 8.16, I'm gonna go read a book and go to bed. Um, but I realized I'm not gonna launch it tonight anyway because even though it's like a soft launch and even though it's like not that big of a deal, um when i post something even sometimes posting videos at night when i when i put something out there at night sometimes when it's important to me uh i will get anxiety and then i can't sleep and i wake up in the middle of the night and i'm like did anybody email me <laughs> and it's ridiculous because even if i launched it right now like i'm sure not a single person would see it because I haven't really been talking about it. I haven't promoted it. Like I haven't, nobody knows that it's happening. Nobody's gonna see it. It doesn't, it's just putting it out there so it's public and it's in Google and people can start searching and finding me. Um, but yeah, so I'm not gonna post it because I don't wanna wake up with anxiety in the middle of the night. But uh, tomorrow morning I have a call with my coach and so we will probably talk about it then and talk about how to promote it because I am really bad at that. I'm really bad at promoting myself. I'm really bad about talking about myself and uh, it's really awkward as you can see because I'm feeling awkward right now. I'm not sure what you can see in the background but I just realized there's like a pile of laundry slightly off here. So I'm hoping I didn't sway the camera that way while I was talking. Anyway, I'm gonna end this so I can edit it and post it and not get anxiety about it. <laughs> while I'm sleeping um, and yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow, which could potentially be exciting.